Good evening, everyone. Today is 5-16-2013. It is 4-20 right now. Woohoo! Um, I have a couple things. So I got a comment, and then I'll move on to, as you can tell, it looks like I have a swollen cheek. I'll move on to uh, <laughs> the, the tumors after the second round and kind of give you guys an update. So I got a comment from Ricky. It said, I think you're in wonderful hands at the Huntsman. I do as well. They're great people up there. Um, I can't help not to chuckle when you say you, you met your max deductible. <laughs> LOL. Only us with medical issues know what that means and happy it makes us. <laughs> yeah, me and my wife, uh, we, we met this one and our family out of one because uh, Kyle had RSV and uh, Isabel just broke her legs so we're just like, yeah, <laughs> no more. So, uh, and then I have a few questions for you. Does Dr. A know when he will start to see start to see results. They say um, it, it's kind of everyone's a little bit different but within 24 hours they've seen some people respond and then at, but typically it's after the 12th week is when everyone has responded enough and you see some real progress. Um, and actually I've already seen some progress. These right here are basically, I mean they're already pretty much gone. Like they're not really there anymore. They're breaking down everything like that so definitely good news. This one and this one are, are kind of swelling up, but that's kind of to be expected. It looks like I have like a in, I don't know, septic, septic tooth or whatever that is. Um, but yeah, they, they just keep injecting this stuff and hopefully or the plan is that it's going to go in and eventually break it down and uh, kind of go from there. Um, I actually, I, so some of the side effects I started to feel yesterday, I, I started to feel like I had a, a really bad fever. And like uh, my whole body was chilled, and I was you know in bed just like sweating and hot, but then cold and all that other stuff. And I was kind of laying there, and I was thinking about you know just uh, okay, this is a good thing. You know my immune system's kicking up, everything's moving forward. You know like this is supposed to happen. This is awesome. And then I I kind of was sitting there, and I'm like, you know what? If I if I if I control this body, and I know what's you know I I know it's just a flesh vehicle, and it's there to make me healthy and everything like that. Well, why am I not communicating with it? So I. I kind of started focusing like, okay, come on immune system, we'll go for the neck, that's where it's at, um, you know, in my cheek, everything like that, and I really started thinking like Pac-Man, 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 so it was, it was really cool, and you know, I woke up this morning, these are, these are looking tremendously better, um, these, this one's, you know, still swollen, this one's still kind of swollen, actually the one on my back, that's the most amazing one, is, is really small, it's really gone down, so uh, systemically I hope, it, you know, I, 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 it's working, and you know, my immune system's getting ramped up and really starting to, to kick some ass. So it's pretty, pretty exciting, and uh, I like that. I, I, I like that. I kind of broke through that mental focus of like, nope, I'm just gonna, I gotta talk to myself, gotta get going, um, you know, and, and gotta direct where, where the healing needs to go. So that was fun. And then I got um, Matt made me a, a, I gave him a picture of me with all this stuff, and he uh, photoshopped all of them out and gave me that. So I'm gonna hang that up on my, uh, on my mirror here, so you can see that. <laughs> Um, and then Jordan, when, when were you first diagnosed with melanoma? I was first diagnosed uh, 4-25 of 2012. I went in for surgery on the lymph nodes on uh, 4-20-2012. So almost a year and a month today? A year and a month, then yeah, a little bit. So um, yeah, that was when I first was diagnosed. So uh, you have an amazing outlook on life. Thank you. I agree. I, I really enjoy. I really enjoy life. It's the most amazing thing. You know, it's, it's just awesome. Um, I like to think I do as well. I believe you do as well. Just from the little interaction with you, you seem like a, you seem like you, you definitely have a good perspective. And you know, I you know our little our little you know was it the, the hospital buddies or whatever it is. We they're, they're have we have unique perspectives for sure. So stay strong, friend. Wish you all the best. Thank you very much, and I uh, wish you all the best as well so um so yeah that's basically that's that's kind of been the last couple of days i've kind of felt a little bit like i said a little under the weather and you know my aches and pains and stuff like that like kind of just like the sickness so i'm gonna take it pretty chill and um you know just kind of hang out uh, i'm going to a bachelor party tonight for kelly i'm pretty excited about it i hadn't haven't done something like this in a long time so it should be really fun um hope you know hope everyone's doing amazing i know i know i'm having a you know great time i'm definitely getting closer and closer to my goals every moment every hour every minute you know and I'd employ you and ask you as you know are you, are you getting closer to where you want to be are you closer now than you were 30 minutes ago or an hour ago and last week or a year or you know five years whatever it is so um yeah I love you all and we'll talk to you all soon peace